My name is Ines Barrenuevo. I am one of the directors of La Prima Sueca, Swedish Casino. I'm Agustina San Martin. I am the other director. The short film is about a young girl who is turning 15 and has to do a, her quinceanera party. And she starts finding herself in a, in a really repressive uh, situation where she has to fit in with this role of role model of, of, of girl. She feels weird and as she starts meeting her Swedish cousin, she starts finding a new aspect of herself and you have to see the short film <laughs> to know the rest. <laughs> Comienza a dormir bien y trata de relajarte lo más que puedas para que ese día estés radiante. Recordar que el rol de la quinceañera es el de divertirse no anda. desde esta fecha evita comer en, e en exceso grasas chocolates puedes callarte En serio te digo, andate. Ámbar. Más rápido. Gorda. A ver. Dame. Ahí está, me dejó beber. Guys, welcome to the festival. Nice to have you here with your movie La Prima Suesa. Um, in the movie, a young girl from Argentina is getting prepared for her 15th birthday. And she slowly gets to know her cousin from Sweden, which she is first uh, estranged. Uh, she first estranges her. And then they get to know a little bit better and they get closer. And um, I want you to want to know from you why did you want to make that movie how did you come up with that idea well uh, we met in the, <laughs> the talent campus last year yes, yes. and then we knew each other and we started talking about some ideas that we had and well she you, so you can, you can she told me <laughs> a specific anecdote ah, yeah, yeah. that happened to her in, in a way and we started talking that it would be a, a a nice short film. Mm -hmm. So suddenly we were both saying, ah, oh, we will never want to co-direct something. Yeah. But suddenly we were writing together this. Oh, okay. And we were like, no, you direct it. No, you direct it. And we found that we wanted both this story to be told. So okay. we started doing it together. And it was a private anecdote from you? Or yeah. Yeah. just uh, I mean, yeah. we changed it, but... Uh, very different. Yeah. yeah. Okay. You, know, you, you start with an idea and then you start to transform in another idea and in another thing and it's like a puzzle that you I mean a construction comes yeah. together yes, slowly. comes together and with yeah. ideas coming from her part and yeah. my ideas all together. Yes. Okay. <laughs> nice. Um, so the girl in the movie Kata is waiting for her fifteenth birthday and she's like really nervous about it and and there's the thing um, when you get when you turn fifteen in Argentina, but in a lot of other countries in Latin America, American countries. Latin America. Yeah. Um, I think this is called Quinceañera. <laughs> yes. <laughs> um, can you tell us a little bit about that? Because we don't have it here in it's Europe. Like a, yeah. a massive, huge event when a girl is like growing up and she's like, she's supposed to be a, a woman now. Actually, yes. Actually, it's socially it was born because they wanted to pretend uh, to present young girls into society for them to get married. Mm. So the quinceañera was when they became a woman, mm -hmm. um, they would be presented in society for them to have uh, interesting rich men. Ah, to okay. take it's like them. a show to yeah. show the girls. Uh, but then it started changing and it started getting into a social pressure where you have to do it, otherwise you're the widow. 
oh, we yes. both took the decision of not doing it, which was, I don't know now with young people now, but at, when I was young, I was the weird one for it's like a, like, not doing it's like it. like a princess of Disney. You, you Something have to like be a that, princess. like with the dress. You put a dress, uh, a very nice dress. You have to dance a balls. Yes. Okay. It's like a wedding, but with yourself being the Amazing. center of attention. Okay, yeah. because that was my next question, uh, yeah. that if you you didn't do it because no. you decided against it, and yeah. how was it for you to uh, decide that, to take that decision? Did you had to face a lot of pressure from your family or...? No. No. no, no, not at all, because in my case, my parents were very like uh, open-minded people, okay. you know? Yeah. Uh, and I prefer to go on a trip. Yeah. <laughs> to Disneyland. It's a stupid also, but mm -hmm. ah, okay. in that choose moment, <laughs> yes. In that moment, you could, you can choose if you go to uh, you do the party or you can go to a Dis Disney, for example. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. But this, uh, for you to imagine, it's more or less the same money going mm -hmm. to Disneyland and then doing the party. Okay. That's the that's the example of how big is the party. Yeah, I see. You know? okay. People yeah. get into debt, mm -hmm. deep economical debts, families to yeah. pay for these parties. Yes. Wow, it's a yeah. It's yeah. like a marriage yeah. kind of it's, thing. It's, yeah, it's a status, a social status okay. thing. That's you interesting. Have to show how much you have, so you put everything on it. Yeah, and yeah, so that makes you more horrible. Yeah, <laughs> and I think the film shows it very well that the pressure the girl is under uh, in the preparations, and uh, her sister always tell her or reads stuff like you can't eat yeah. a lot of food before that, and you have to look pretty and all that stuff. And all that is actually it's, it's real. We took it from real, real magazine. Real magazine. Yeah. for yeah. quinceañeras. For quinceañeras. <laughs> there are magazines for it. Yes. Yeah. No way. No, it's a <laughs> like like yeah, like a marriage. Yeah. <laughs> and that was were the actual words. You have to avoid fats and chocolates. <laughs> That's crazy. Okay. <laughs> okay. Um, and that for me reflects maybe also the situation for women or for young girls in Argentina. Is there a lot of pressure how they have to behave or how they have to look and how is the situation? This is still a conservative uh, yeah. society. It's really conservative. We have a lot of people that do this kind of things, uh, parties and Uh, get married by church, and, you know, Catholics, yeah. a lot of Catholic people with a very high mor morality about a lot of things. Yeah. Uh, so, I don't know. Yeah. Yeah, we, we have very different yeah. contexts, yes. mm -hmm. but we do share the same, yes. the, the same relationship with them. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. So we have different explanations, but it's the same, actually. <laughs> okay. And for me in the movie, it was like the girls, they had like one bubble because you never see the parents. And mm, I think yeah. in one scene you hear, you hear them, you hear but them they have fighting. like a fighting, it, yeah. but you never, and that for me represents the, the outside world, which is maybe could be a threat for them. Yeah. And then there's this, these girls who are having their own kind of world, building it up. Was it your attention or? Yes, it was yeah. intention. Because, yes, when well, you're... When adults are not there, you know, they, like they you're would free never to do. They would never understand. Yeah. When you are that age, you don't feel that any no. adults ever would ever understand yes. the pain you're in. Yeah. Yes. I mean, they, they always say things that have nothing to do with what you're dealing with. Yeah. But they minimize that, so, yeah. Yes, yes, to avoid the parents was a decision. Yeah. Because you just, you just have the attention on, 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 the, on girls. the girls, you know. Yeah. And um, the Swedish cousin, she's more a casual girl, and yeah. she has her short, <laughs> uh, short hair, and yeah. she likes to wear trousers. Did it for you some, had an ex aspect that the girls represent the country they're from, like the status of education or something like that? Because like Sweden is a more educated yeah. place, and Argentina is more, yeah. they need to have some process or progress going on. Yeah. 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 Yes, yes. I, I mean, um, the story it came from uh, some Swedish people that I knew in a festival, and they were so much different from ah, me and from okay. my country, you know, uh, in, her, 
and their style and mm. their clothes and everything I mean, and their thoughts. Think, yeah. It's a very open society, like mm -hmm. one of the mo most open yeah. from the world. I don't know. Mm -hmm. in the like we, we, we had no, no intention of making like a binary no. No. between black or white uh, dress or trousers, mm -hmm. but the thing is that um, it is a, a, a it is a, um, a complex uh, issue about yes. genre. Genre? Do you say? Genre. Genre? Genero. Genero. Gen a woman, man. General. Yeah, yeah. No, genre. Gen genre. Genero. Gen uh, for the gender. No. Gender. 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 Yes. <laughs> so it is, it is a, a conflict in, yeah. in gender. And it was, in yeah. this anecdote, this was like this. And we yeah. thought that even though it may look like it was mm -hmm. a binary, it was still something really honest that still happens. Yeah, of course. You have short hair in, in a conservative private school in Argentina. Mm -hmm. You are probably being looked as weird. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. It's basic, but it's <laughs> really like that. <laughs> yeah. Um, let's talk about the queer aspect in the movie. Yes. And for me, it's inter I'm interested in the situation in Argentina. I had the feeling like it, there was a progress going on. It got better the last years. Yes. Yes, there is. Yes. You think yes. so too? What is your yes. feeling about that? Yes, there is. Yeah. Uh, Because of the marriage equality that was in yes. 2010. And another loss. Yes. Were well, actually, Buenos Aires is is a pretty gay, gay friendly place. But uh, still, we were really, uh, we, we, we knew that we were talking about our experiences mm -hmm. joined together in this story. We don't know how mm. girls nowadays are dealing with this. Mm. Okay. Yeah. Yet, it was for us something that connected deeply with what we, in the past, found, where we found pain somewhere. Mm -hmm. Okay. I think you did it in a very good way. <laughs> Thank you. Um, and I think the movie shows in a very sensitive way how the girls get closer to each other and how the, yeah. you know, the boundaries mm -hmm. are slowly breaking away or whatever. Mm -hmm. How did you communicate with the girls your view of this relationship? How did you talk to them? It was, it was easy. It was pretty easy because um, one of the girls uh, came to the casting, the, the the main character, mm -hmm. um, what's her name? The girly mm. one. The girl. Kata, <laughs> no? Kata. Yeah, Kata, Kata, Kata. Yeah. And the other girl, the other actress, I, I knew her. Mm -hmm. um, she was she was more confident. And we talked a little a little bit more with, with her about mm -hmm. some things because the other girl was like inexperienced she uh, was, acting. Yeah. You know, okay. it was mm -hmm. her first time. Mm -hmm. Doing, and doing she a came film. from a very conservative family yes, also. Yes. Oh, wow. I mean, the cross she had yes. in her neck it was hers. Yes, yes. She, she, she couldn't believe she. She was. She couldn't sort believe the, the story. Character. Yes. Oh, wow. For her, it was the but weirdest was, story ever. Yeah. Yes. <laughs> so yes. how was it for her personally to be part of the movie? We we, we talked about <laughs> She's it. Really happy uh, we, now. we were really <laughs> afraid. Yeah. yeah. We were really afraid that she yes. would she would uh, feel weird and and get like cold with us mm -hmm. but we said we were going to explain everything yes. so naturally that she was going to be like okay and we did it and it, it happened was, that it way. It was okay, mm -hmm. it was easy. We, we decided it was easier than we, than, yeah, we, than we, we thought. Yeah, we thought a lot about yes, it and yes. it was actually really easy. Yes. Nice. We just had to be natural about it. Mm -hmm. She or make her feel comfortable and everything is cool. Yeah. yeah, nothing's gonna happen. <laughs> Just a film. <laughs> we'll be happy afterwards. Yeah. And now she's happy? She's really, really happy. Yeah, she's yes. really happy. She's really excited about it. Yes, she's not an actress, yes. Yes. <laughs> nice. Um, so, your movie is running in the section Generation, which is for younger people. Um, or for the younger audience. Why did you want to make a film for the younger generation? And especially I don't know if, if, if we want to topic. do it for younger generation. It's about young generation, yeah. but it's, it's not for spe specific. 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 Yeah. Yeah. I mean, the, the festival decides where to put the film, but the film, I, I, I mean, I think that my parents would see the film and we will like, like the I film. I think my parents will like the film okay, also. Yeah. It's, it's like, it's about 
it's for everyone. It's, about, it's, yes. it's, it's an important but issue. That was so everyone can yes. yes. so yes. watch it. Yeah. Yeah. Raming. Yes. That, yeah. Okay. Um, but you know that your te uh, your film is competing for a Teddy Award. Yeah. So no. How do you feel about that? <laughs> <laughs> you don't want to talk about that. You're afraid. You're afraid. Why? Why? No. <laughs> No, well, yesterday was no. a screening of the Teddy, mm -hmm. yeah. and yeah, we there were really good short films. Mm -hmm. yes. Yeah. Ah, yes. because of that, okay. No. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, they were very really good. Were, they, they were, were like, were yeah, good. okay. Ah, they were okay. good. We okay. were like, okay. <laughs> <laughs> Respect. <laughs> okay. Uh, no, we're happy to be in the, yeah. in, in the world. Of course, it's like a very mythical award from the Berlinale. Yeah. You know, it's like every, everyone knows about the Teddy. Yeah. Uh, It would be an honor to... And an interesting visibility also. Yes. Of course. Yes. So <laughs> do you have any more projects planned so far? Are there... We yes. both have. I'm shooting my second feature film this year, June. Okay. So I just returned to Argentina. And In June? In June, yes. Yeah. And returned to Argentina and just put my head. So yeah, today I have to work because yeah. nice. I have a lot of things to do to work on. So well, do you, can, what is it about? Uh, uh, you don't want to talk about it? No, it's you okay. Don't need to. It's a storyline. It's a story. <laughs> it's about um. Oh my God! Can I tell you? I, I was not prepared for this question. Can I, can <laughs> I feature film? <laughs> she no. wants to yeah, of course. She, she tells she tells the film better Because than I like than, it. Than, than me. Okay, uh, it's a, a story. Life. Yeah. Okay. It, it, about a, a woman in her 50s that once was an, an important actress, and now uh, found that she has to go back to a <laughs> summer house that mm -hmm. she had with her daughter, and she starts getting into a, an obscure place, and Ooh. her daughter starts being independent from her, mm -hmm. and they start. <laughs> making a different kind of bond mm -hmm. and realizing that that is okay too. Okay. She doesn't love her daughter. It's more or less about that. Oh, that's a serious <laughs> topic. Like a yeah. that, that that's why I like. Doesn't it. want to be mother. <laughs> yeah. You know? Yeah. Sounds interesting. Yeah. And uh, you? <laughs> and I'm planning on filming I tell, my. I tell you so. <laughs> yeah. Now no, it's your turn, right? It's very difficult. <laughs> it's difficult. I, would, I don't know. Uh, I'm filming my feature long film uh, mm -hmm. at the beginning of next year, mm -hmm. and yeah, and that, was, that was yeah. What is it about? <laughs> oh, uh, it's no. difficult. Suspense. <laughs> okay. <laughs> no, it's it's long. Yeah. Okay. It's, it's, it's long. a surprise. It's it's about a it's about a, a young teenager that goes back to to the province where she was born, the, mm -hmm. the jungle. And uh, she starts searching for her brother, mm -hmm. and as she continues searching for her brother, she starts discovering herself uh, sexually, herself uh, with other people, in contact with other people, and then she decides she no longer needs what's not there for her. Mm -hmm. and it's this quest. And did that. you write the um, screenplay? Yeah, well? I was actually in the script station yesterday with that. Yesterday. Script. Yes, the, last, <laughs> year. last year. <laughs> in the talent event. <laughs> okay, interesting. Yeah. Well, then, thank you for thank you much. having me for the interview. and uh, Thank you for the talk. Yeah, <laughs> thank you too. Have a nice time at the Bellinale.